Hey guys, what's up? It's Kamudi. What? <laughs> and I'm here today to do a college video. These have been my most requested, my most wanted, my most sought after videos basically if you're new here hi i'm kamudi um please be sure to like and subscribe i have a lot of new college videos coming up i'm gonna do a freshman advice truth about college parties um what to expect in college what to ring your dorm all that type of stuff so that's coming up soon i'm gonna be a sophomore at the university of minnesota that's old that's really old wow Today, I will be talking about the truth about college. I'm gonna be debunking those myths that you've probably heard, you know. We're gonna get into the dirt, the tea, as you might say, the tea. Okay, so let's just get started. First thing, I'm gonna divide this into categories. So we have the one that everybody wants to know. Everybody always wants the tea when I see them the boys and then social life classes because that's what college is and then dorm and other stuff pretty much first I don't I don't want to let anyone down I don't maybe it was just my personal experience but when I talk to other people you are gonna see a lot of beautiful faces in college a lot a lot like I had to hold myself back because, wow. You're gonna see a lot of that. But honestly, some of them can be very, how do I, how do I say this lightly? Um, trash, they can be trash. I know a lot of girls come into college thinking I'm gonna get a relationship, I'm gonna do all this. Honestly, most people on both sides want something pretty casual and like, honestly, if you go into college having a boyfriend or getting a boyfriend, beautiful um but basically kind of like what i want you guys to keep in mind is to always be like on the lookout <laughs> wait no always like know where your head is at and know what you want basically the truth about college is that not like all guys really want a relationship and like most of them don't so just keep that in mind so the next thing that i'm gonna be talking about is social life myth number one you're gonna be partying all the time no, that's wrong. Honestly, like I went out a lot, but during the weekends and when I got stuff done, like honestly, I like still prioritized prioritized my schoolwork. And honestly, you guys should do that too because you go to college, you pay so much money and like don't just like, yeah. So like college people, they don't party like every single day. Like they still go to class. Like, and if you're not, drop out. That's the truth. Another myth is that you're gonna become best friends with the people you're living with and the people in your dorm. I mean, no, you may not. Honestly, if you are, that's like amazing, but sometimes people don't stay friends with like their roommate or stuff. Basically, when you live together, it's different than meeting someone on Facebook or anything like that. So you wanna like just be aware that you're not always gonna become best friends with your roommates. So be on the lookout, but always remember that you wanna find friends, you know, in your classes, in your hall, blah, blah, blah. Um, the next myth is that if you don't join like a frat or a sorority, you aren't cool and you're not gonna have friends. That's fake because I'm not in a frat. I'm not in a sorority and I have friends. We're good. We're doing great. Honestly, if you do want to join that, I was considering it, but honestly, I was like, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. I was kind of iffy, but I know a lot of people that join it love it and that's great if you want to do it, but like you also don't have to join it if you think that's your only way of making friends because you will make a lot of friends and you'll go to parties like you'll be fine next myth i have is that you will have the freshman 15. honestly i didn't have the freshman 15. i ate a lot and there are a lot of foods that are available but you're not always going to gain weight and if you like manage that especially with walking in campus like a lot of that walking like helps you lose weight so freshman 15 isn't always real so just keep that in mind but just also be healthy next thing is that a liberal arts degree will do nothing for you. There's a lot of different majors in liberal arts. Like I am in liberal arts right now and I'm a computer science major. And you know, computer science people make, they make bank. So do what you want, follow your dream because ultimately majors don't really matter. It's what skills you have that actually matter. So like focus on like gaining skills and like doing good stuff. 
and then you'll like get your dream job basically a myth is that majors set your future which they do not they do not like you can honestly major in something and like have a completely different career like i know people who majored in like english and they're like now working in like comp side departments and stuff like that so like majors don't define your future like find something you like to do find something that you know like if your parents like my parents want you to make money find something that will make money but also kind of combines the things you love to do myth you're gonna graduate in four years not everyone graduates in four years and even people who don't graduate in four years um, only graduate late just because they wanted to like take more classes that they that focus on their career or like they're a double major like it doesn't matter and no one's gonna judge you for it because so many people graduate after four years people will graduate early but also a lot of people graduate after four years because they want to take more classes and stuff like that the next myth that I have Skip class, it'll be fine. No. Don't skip class. You dumb. <sighs> Don't skip class because even if you miss one day, honestly, it's a lot of information and like that little part that you missed on that day will be on the test that you take. So don't miss class. Another myth is that you'll be homesick at the beginning of the year. Like, or not the beginning. Like you'll only be homesick at the beginning of the year. That's like not true because um, although you are having fun, there are going to be moments where you're like, wish I could eat some good food right now. So just be prepared for those little moments where you're like, I really wish I was sleeping in my like room, my bed or whatever. The next one I have is that finals week will kill you. Honestly, this is kind of true, but you will get through it. You will get through it, I believe in you. I barely got through it, but I did get through it and you will too, so bam. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I know I kind of went really fast in talking about them, but there are so many college videos lined up. I literally have like 10 on my phone. So, we have a lot to talk about. Be sure to subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.